So I'm trying to do a video here comparing two cabinet door samples that we just got in. This one is from Planet Fancy Cabinetry, and on my left here is from Waypoint. Waypoint is a stock, somewhat semi-custom cabinet line that we carry. It's entry-level price point. Planet Fancy is full custom and a premium luxury cabinet, both in a painted blue finish, as you can see. Uh, so what are some of the differences uh, to start waypoint as i said you mostly stock cabin line you're not able to modify the widths depths heights uh the depths you can but it's uh it's also going to be made with more affordable materials you just have a lot less options uh it's a framed cabinetry cabinet framed full overlay uh so you're gonna have, you don't have the option of doing something like this where it's inset, where the door and the drawer sit within the frame of the cabinet. Um, with Planet Fancy, you could do inset, full overlay, full overlay frameless cabinetry. With Waypoint, those options are not available. Uh, with Planet Fancy, you can modify the width, height, depth down to 1 16th of an inch. Uh, you could specify if you want this to be a slab, uh, you can do that too as well with this. You could say you want a slab here instead of a five-piece shaker style. Uh, but you can get really intricate with how you want to modify the door. You could do a beaded inset. I've done other videos on beaded inset. Uh, but in terms of the paint finish itself, here we're looking at a satin finish. You could choose matte, satin, uh, semi-gloss, and I believe even they'll go uh, there's one more sheen in there that I'm forgetting. I, I believe there are four options for your sheen level of paint versus here. It's, it's, uh, it's just like more of a matte finish. That's, that's the only option. Uh, and then with Plain and Fancy, of course, there are, uh, uh, endless amounts of door styles to choose from versus Waypoint. It is a little bit limited. Uh, you also have a lot more wood species. They're using grade A, uh, if you're doing like a walnut, it's grade A walnut. Um, so, but uh, I'm pointing out some of the differences between these two doors. This is a five piece. It's a solid wood construction. Waypoint is one of the, uh, probably one of the only cabin lines that we carry that still offers solid wood construction, which actually carries a downside with it. Uh, solid wood construction for a painted cabinet door. Uh, the downside is you're going to get, you can begin to see this is a brand new door, but you can see where the joints are here. It's got, it's going to each door, shaker door is going to have uh, five or four joints uh, for the door and the drawer. Um, so as that wood expands and contracts with moisture, you're going to start to get these hairline fractures. Uh, if I zoom in, I'm not sure if it'll translate on the, on the video, but there are just also just some imperfections with the wood where there's these minor little pecks, uh, and you could call them. Uh, and I don't know that it's really translating on the on the video here. Um, they're coming through, but there are several of them throughout the door. Uh, overall, it's a great looking. I mean, it's a nice looking cabinet. Uh, but if you're someone that's going to get really picky, um, you know, you're going to have some imperfections with wood in general but if you're not using a grade a lumber um, you're going to have more of those imperfections um, but you know as with anything you get what you pay for it if you want the premium luxury if if you have the money and resources to spend on cabinetry uh, that you know you're getting those things with plain and fancy cabinetry uh, the price point for you know if you're looking at an l-shaped kitchen with an island it's going to be tens of thousands of dollars that we're talking about here uh, for more for plain and fancy and an inset uh, inset cabinet. So with this door, it's actually, uh, the door and drawer are all one piece. It's an MDF, uh, fiberboard material with, made with a, uh, it's, it's a, a fine crushed powder mixed with a resin, uh, pine wood is used and it's a very heavy, dense material. Uh, so it doesn't move. That's the benefit. And it's all one piece. You couldn't do that with a shaker, with a, with a solid wood material. 
So the benefit is there are no joints here or here. Now the frame itself will have joints. If you're doing a framed inset, uh, you're gonna have those joints. However, the door itself, you don't ever have to worry about expansion joints if you're doing painted cabinetry, especially uh, if you're doing white painted cabinetry, you're really gonna see those hairline fractures. So, uh, you know, and then just to, it, it's hard to tell in person, but you don't have those like little, little uh, pock marks or whatever you wanna call them, uh, like you do, they're, they're, it's no imperfections in the, in the wood material. It's a, a perfect paint finish. Uh, so, you know, not to, to say anything bad about Waypoint, I think Waypoint is a great offering for the price point. Uh, and you can do a lot with Waypoint. And if you have a creative designer or design team like we do, uh, that, that can really think outside the box and you have a good installer, a good cabinet installer is also key. Uh, you can do a lot with a cabinet line like Waypoint. Uh, so with, with something like a plan of fancy, you also have to have a, uh, you know, if you're, if you have a working with a showroom that carries a cabinet line like this, they have to have a team that is able to handle a custom cabinet line such as plain and fancy. They're able to turn around quotes. Uh, it's it's a, quite a bit more labor intensive to design with, uh, to, to know that, I mean, it, we're talking a spec book about uh, well over a thousand pages versus something that's a couple hundred pages. Uh, so it's, it's really an advanced cabinet line, uh, but just have the people, have someone that can design it also somebody that can quote it and review the quote and review the plans. And, you know, it's, it's very easy to miss like one thing, uh, in a cabinet quote, um, from plan and fancy that could cost a thousand, two thousand uh, dollars or more. Um, so, you know, that's something to keep in mind is, is you have to be working with a, a firm that's able to, um, uh, take full advantage of the capabilities of the cabinet line that, and uh, maximize, um, you know, what you're paying for. So anyway, I think, I think that that's, um, you know, just another angle here. Uh, another thing with Plain and Fancy is you can do custom colors, pretty much any color from Benjamin Moore or Sherwin Williams. Uh, custom colors are available uh, with Waypoint. Uh, that's not something that's available. Um, so Waypoint right now, their lead times are extended because there are shortages due to the to the COVID. Um, but uh, right now it's six to seven weeks, plain and fancy is 10 to 12. Normally that's like four weeks for Waypoint and eight to 10 weeks for plain and fancy. So that's something that, to keep in mind as well. Um, so what are your thoughts? Any, uh, which do you prefer? Uh, does, you know, are you somebody that really wants a custom cabinet? Do you like the inset look? Are you okay with, uh, you know, it's something where you can go on to Waypoint's website or, or a request a brochure or must between the two and see a full kitchen uh, and what that looks like in a full overlay that Waypoint offers versus inset or full overlay that Plan and Fancy offers. Uh, what's really beneficial is, uh, you know, if you go through a design process with us, we are able to, now usually you wouldn't be comparing Plain and Fancy versus Waypoint, usually be Plain and Fancy versus Dura Supreme or Belmont. Um, maybe you would be looking at Belmont 1600 versus Waypoint. We, we have that flexibility. We carry six cabinet lines. We do have the flexibility to uh, prepare quotes for you within uh, you know, multiple cabinet lines if you're trying to stay on a budget. So hope you liked the video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Uh, if you have any feedback or or, you know, if there's one that you prefer, please comment down below.